Well, let's turn to Abuja, where the Chairman National Hatch Commission, Zikrullah Hassan, has announced the total hatch fare for the year 2023. The cost per person is within the range of 2.8 to 2.9 million naira, and this will include all expense from transportation, accommodation, and other sundry items. Miriam Mohammed reports. Every year, Muslims across the world go on Hajj pilgrimage in order to fulfill one of the pillars of Islam. In Nigeria, preparations towards the Hajj has always come with a host of challenges, including cancellations and delays of flights. The Commission is hoping to forestall these shortcomings this year. This is why the Commission has decided to announce the fair for 2023 on time to enable pilgrims prepare themselves. The airlines approved by the federal government are Airpeace, Asman, Aero Contractor, Max Air, Arik Air and Valujet as chartered aircraft for tour operators. And uh, our people have to go back home. The increase of Hajj fare this year is due to inflation rates in Nigeria and Saudi Arabia, increase in price of aviation fuel, dollar rates, which applies to countries across the world. At this conference, the chairman National Hajj Commission, Zikrullah Kunle Hassan, goes through the breakdown of fares for each geopolitical zones. The fares fall within the ranges of 2.8 to 2.9 million naira per person. The Hajj fare, incidentally, has eight different costs. Maituguri and Yola departure centers in the northeast the pilgrims in those places are meant to pay 2,890,000, and this includes their BTA. For the other northern states, we have agreed that the cost will be 2,919,000. South alone has six different price regime. Edo, South, South, and South East are on is 2,968,000 Ekiti and in those states is 2,880,000 Oshun state is 2,993,000 and Cross River incidentally the cheapest is on 2,943,000 naira the portal for registration of those paying through Hajj Savings Scheme will be closed today. The Commission appealed to intended pilgrims to complete payment for this year's Hajj by April 21st, 2023. Mare Mohammed, TVC News, Abuja.